Hey everyone, TechnoMinger here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your video not playing or loading on your iPhone. So if you're having any issues, whether it's a video on your photos album or on a app like Safari or YouTube, you're going to follow these steps. First thing is you're going to pull down the control menu, put your phone on airplane mode, and then turn that off. There's a quick network refresh. And after that, you're going to go into your setting and then go all the way down to apps and then find the Photos app. So we're going to go to Photos here. And from here on, we're going to just simply turn off iCloud and then click on either of these options and then turn it back on. So on and off. And then make sure you're selected to download and keep original. You want that setting turned on. And then if you have cellular or mobile data, you're going to tap on that. And then you want to ensure that this setting is turned on so you can download the photos, the videos that are on your iCloud, even through your uh, cellular mobile data. But keep in mind, this can take up your data. Now, the next thing you want to go ahead and do is a little trick here that is going to help you. So if it's a video or you're having issues with that's not loading, what you're going to do is try to click on the edit option. So this is the edit option, and it looks like you're going to try to edit this video, but you're not going to really edit it. You try to just make a little tweak to it, hit done right and then you're just going to save video what that will do it'll allow to make sure that video files are loaded up now if you did this and you're still having an issue the thing to do is just quit out the app so if it's a photos app whether the youtube app you're going to swipe up and just simply slide to close it to make sure the app and then relaunch the app just to make sure there's no issues there now another thing you also want to consider is if you're running on that video on safari or any browser what you're going to do is go into the setting for that browser and clear the cache so in here i'm going to go to settings apps and then look for safari as an example here so let's go ahead and find for example in my case here i'm going to go to safari and then here we're going to go ahead and down here to clear history and website data and you can do it for all time click on clear and that's going to go ahead and clear it, and then you want to relaunch it again now the next thing you want to do if you're still having issues is back in the settings here, right? You want to make sure that if you have battery, you have low power mode. If this is on, you need to turn that off. That will limit functionality of your phone. After you've done that, you're going to follow this step. You're going to quickly press and release the volume up, volume down, and then hold on to this side button. I quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then I hold on to the side button just like that. And we're going to wait until the phone goes completely shut down and then the apple logo will reappears and then it will let go of this side button so you're going to go ahead and let go and this is also known as basically a forced restart now if this doesn't work for you just keep on trying it or you can also just turn off your phone and then restart it again to make sure there's no glitch with the phone so we're going to wait for this and this method will not delete any of your data after you have done that the next thing we're going to do is Go into your settings and then go to general and then ensure that you do not have any BPN turned on. If you do, turn off your BPN. Along with that, back in your settings and then general is iPhone storage. You're going to make sure you have enough storage available. I have 88 gigs here. If you're down to the last couple gig, you want to delete some photos, videos, apps to clear up some state space. Sometimes it needs space to play those and reload those videos. Now, if that isn't working for you, the next thing to do is just going into your settings and then general, software update, update your phone to the latest version. And then last thing you want to do, again, starting from the settings, go to general, scroll down, and then transfer reset. Click on reset. You want to do a network reset. Network reset resets the network settings themselves. Again, really important to do that if you're still having issues. And after all that, I hope you're video can play now if so please consider like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks we'll see you guys next time